chance. I'm hurting for the first time in six months. But I'm not supposed to hurt anymore. I'm supposed to be invulnerable. Instead, one arm's dislocated. Some ribs feel cracked. And one eye swelling shut. And my friends. It's killing my friends. It's killing my friends. Why am I standing here like a fool? You bastard! I'll kill you! I summon what's left of my courage and even get mad. Hercules! No! It's smoke! Forza! And my legs are gone! Save yourself! Get Starburst out of here! I'm gonna try something! Jamal's gonna cut loose. Could take on half the neighborhood. Have to make this fast! At least I can still jump. He killed himself. I try to yell my friend's name, but the explosion blots out my scream. Windows shatter five miles away from the concussive force. Then I die. The devastation's incredible. DJ Blast apparently used all his power at once to destroy the creature. The explosion caused the pieces of cement and other debris to rain down on a five-mile radius. So far, over 30 people have received injuries from the explosion. Several minor car accidents were also reported. But the greatest devastation has been made to the superhero team known as The Squad. Of the original team, only Hardcase and Starburst have survived. DJ Blast and Forza were killed in the explosion. Starburst has been listed in critical condition and there is little hope of recovery. As for Hardcase, his publicist says he plans to... Hello, Doctor. Anything new you can tell me? I'm afraid not. She received serious brain damage from a blow to the head. It's unlikely she'll ever recover. What did this to her? I don't know. It wasn't human. And it was more powerful than any of us. It just attacked out of the blue. We didn't have a chance to find out where it came from. We thought we were the only Ultras on the planet. We were wrong. What, what do you plan to do now? Put those guns down or you're gonna regret it! Smoke him! Come. That was great, Tom. Take a break and we'll call you when we're set up for the fight scene. I changed careers, if you want to call it that. Now I play myself in the movies. Man, I'm glad this wasn't for real. I'd hate to be taking you on. What a jump! Thanks. Offers came in, the money was good, so what the hell? I was going to take a break, suck down a Pellegrino, but Justin Kuttner had to show his face. Hey, Tom, I need to talk to you. After you. Kuttner's a pain in the ass, but he's also my co-star. So, he got right to the point. I've been reading the script over, counting the lines. And I see you have a lot more than I do. I want you to talk to the director and have him beef up my role. I should have at least as many lines as you do. Personally, I think I should have more. You're kidding, right? Newsflash, pal, you're playing my sidekick. I don't remember this movie being about you. And I got news for you, Sport. Before you became Hardcase, you were just another wannabe actor in this bird. Tom Hawk, who was probably washing dishes at Musso and Frank's or delivering pizza. Me? I was acting. I've been acting for ten years. Yeah, you were a teen heartthrob in the 80s whose career faded when your face cleared up, BFD. You were also an alcoholic at 14 and a coke addict at 16, doing the rehab number when it was hip. The way I see it, you're lucky to be working with your attitude. I see you're no help. I guess I'll have to talk to the producer. Be my guest. 
As Kuttner left, a cop came to see me. Mr. Hawk, do you have a minute? Sure, what's up? I was wondering if you could sign this poster for my son. He's a big fan of yours. No prob, come in. Enjoy it while you can, jerk. Say, uh, my pals on the force were wondering when you're coming back to help us on the street. The squad was a big help. I've given that up for now. How come? I'm the only real survivor of the squad, and I was lucky. I still don't know what attacked us, but I know I failed to deal with it properly. Even if I am an Ultra, that doesn't mean I'm any good in a serious crisis. I let my friends down. Let them down in a big way. Hey, you guys were great! Shutting down all those crack houses and all the community service you did? I know you could do good work out there if you tried. Maybe. But fighting drug dealers is one thing. Until that last day, we've never faced anything really powerful. I'm not sure what I could do against another Ultra. Mr. Lone, great to see you again. Uh, how can we help you today? I'm making a withdrawal. All five million. And don't take too long. I've got a limo waiting with two Laker girls inside. Uh, I hope it's not because you don't like our service here. Everybody on the floor! I'm taking this place down! Hell, I don't know why I'm telling you all this. It must blow your image of superheroes. No, man. I understand the pressure you live under. Don't forget, I'm a cop. Our lives aren't exactly fun and games either, but we deal with it. All units. Excuse me. All units. A 211 in progress at Bank of LA at 351 Flower. There's a bank robbery nearby. They're going to need me. Want to come along? We might be able to use you. I'd better stay here. They're supposed to be shooting the next scene in a few minutes. Suit yourself. Take care. You too. Put your hands on your head! Okay. Oops! You meant my head, not your head. Sorry! <laughs> you the manager, Squirt? Uh, yes, sir. Well, I want that some money. Pronto! Or you're gonna be wearing your intestines for a necktie. And hurry up! Your hands up now! Card case, the movie, scene four, take one. Gunfire, and nearby. Bullets don't phase me, suckers! Darren, I have to leave for a few minutes. There's a bank robbery going on nearby. Tom, don't be ridiculous! Do you know how much money the shoot costs per minute? Bill me! I can do about a mile a jump. Another talent allows me to focus on distant sounds so I know where to go. Wow! <laughs> I knew it was a bad scene before I got there. Hurry up with that money! You wanna end up like these losers? Put him down! No! Well, well, well. If it isn't hard, Case, I thought you sold out became a movie star. Either way, I'm glad you're here. I might as well make my debut by killing the world-famous Hard Case. I won't say it again. Put him down. You want him? Take him! He's dead. And I only just talk- Come to daddy, schmuck! This guy's as powerful as I am. Maybe more. Only one way to find out. Ha <laughs> ha! What name do I put on your tombstone, chump? Head Knocker! He's more powerful. You're the one needing a tombstone! I can't let him win. Can't fail. This time. Where you going, Wimp? 
running away? <laughs> Not! I can lose. Never again! Never! I had heard of other Ultras appearing recently. He must be one of them. This guy must have gotten his power when the squad did, but kept out of the public eye until now. How many others are there? And that thing that attacked us, are there more of them? Looks like retirement is out of the question. Looks like I'm back. So there you have it. Hardcase has decided to return to being a superhero, and none too soon. Headknocker, the criminal he managed to subdue, was at least as powerful as Hardcase. A special holding cell is being prepared for him when he wakes up. This is Nancy Kaplan in Los Angeles for GNS. Somewhere far away, deep down within the earth, a man who isn't a man feels annoyed. He doesn't allow himself to feel annoyed often, but he can't control himself this time. Hard case is still alive. NME failed. And now this other Ultra has appeared in Los Angeles, and many more in San Francisco, and several others the media has yet to discover. The man who isn't a man begins to feel angry. If half the world must die this time, he thinks, all the better. <laughs> <laughs>